Hi guys, this is Matthias Anders with Click. Today we would like to introduce the ClickSense agent to you. Before taking a look at a live demonstration, let's see what it is about. The ClickSense agent is a solution that helps you to enforce governance for your entire Click landscape and to enable govern self-service. In fact, the solution addresses a lot of challenges that we see at companies using BI software and that want to enable self-service. The ClickSense agent addresses challenges from a BICC or IT perspective like applying governance to self-service processes, providing a central catalog of available content and functionality, governed data provisioning, avoiding local data copies, and at least supporting business users publishing apps with corporate security. From a business user perspective, the solution addresses challenges like easy to use central catalog for available content and functionality, to reuse governed data models and together with trusted data, and of course avoiding manual work and reusability of centrally managed content. Our proposed solution is to provide an easy to use and simple web-based portal and provide a strong guidance for the specific use cases. The solution should be able to integrate with other existing value-added services like the Governed Metric Service, the QMC Utilities, the Click Data Concierge or others. The solution should also be able to connect to all Click solutions and not even click solutions, maybe other BI solutions or other content-based solutions to provide a unified information overview. Let's take a look at the live demonstration. The user interface of the ClickSense agent is as simple as possible. We can just type in a keyword into the search box. Let's search for content related to sales. The metadata-driven search includes measures, dimensions, app owners, apps, of course, streams, app descriptions and other stuff that our entire Click platform provides. Let's select app names that contain the name Sales. Now we see the search results in the form of business cards. This is a structured way to present the most important information of applications to us. We also see that we are able to find applications from ClickSense and ClickView. We also see that some applications are highlighted as certified apps. This means that those applications are verified by BICC and are based on governed content. We might also see apps to which we don't have access to but are able to initiate the request for access to this app. Of course, we can directly open an app, or maybe we just want to preview the content. Let's just flip those business cards. Now we will see a preview of those applications and the visualizations that are inside those applications. See this line chart within Finance, Sales and Operational Planning application. We can also select to see the next visualization, or even take a look at more than one application to see the preview of those visualizations. You can also see that the content is somehow animated and we get a preview of more visualizations that are inside. We can refine our search all the time. Let's search for the measure sales amount in which we are interested in. The AdventureWorks app seems to include the data that we are looking for. Let's start self-service for this particular app. The ClickSense agent created a new application on our sandbox environment for us. This application points to our central and governed data model and we can use it for self-service purposes. We can directly jump into this application or directly jump into data preparation.
Let's convert those scripted tables into bubbles. Now we can see the data model that we are easily able to enhance with our personal data. In our case, we have some product categories defined in an Excel sheet, which we just want to drag and drop into this data model. We see our new table inserted into the governed data model, and we can, of course, easily link this using the wizard and enhance the central data. Our self-service application will always be linked to the governed data model. So at least we can benefit from regular data refreshes or even changes within the central definition of this governed content. It's also very easy to publish this application to a broader community because it also includes the corporate security definitions. And as an additional feature, PICC can easily identify all personal changes to the core data model to reflect this by publishing the application. Let's go to the app overview to see that we didn't only reflect to the central data model, but we also consumed the central definition of dimensions and measures from the governed content. Based on those master items, of course, it's very easy for us to create a new application by using drag and drop, create new visualizations, and use the standard features of ClickSense. Going back to the ClickSense agent, we can see that we can enable some options. For example, we can only choose to see only published apps within our search results or only take a look at certified apps. We can just instantly see how it limits the number of applications that are available through this search options. Of course, you can easily extend this solution by your own self-service process definitions that you have in your organization or even extend the content that is retrievable through the search engine in the background. This is just based on a standard click application which can connect to any kind of data source in the background. We hope that we were able to provide you a good overview on how you can satisfy your business users and your BICC within your organization with the help of the ClickSense agent. It should also help you to create trust in your data and enable faster decision making. You will be able to implement your customer specific use cases today. You can download or contribute to the ClickSense agent as an open source project on branch.click.com. Even Click Consulting Service can help you to implement a supported environment for it. Thanks for watching this video and see you soon on branch.click.com.